What's up guys, this is Bob Bobson6868 and today I've got for you my number two Moab, second Moab in my career. And I'm sorry, I apologize right now that I wasn't recording this when I was playing. Actually, uh, just before the Moab streak I was like, no way I'm going to get a Moab. So I started recording and you'll see the screen go black for a few seconds, that's just me hitting the capture on my program. But this first part is from my live stream and it was one of my first live streams so I didn't really have it set very well so the videos you know not full screen and it's kind of low quality oh first blood <laughs> and, and um the audio is terrible terrible audio but um this is going to be a 96 percent shotgun uh moab which means i got one kill with the p90 and the rest with the usas using the specialist strike package and if you can get if you can just last long enough to get damage on a shotgun you know it's so good you're gonna see me get so many kills with the shotgun you're gonna want to throw up a little bit but but uh what i want to talk about today is camping and the moab itself um not just on my videos, but a lot of times on my videos and a lot of other videos I see, people are just always trying to say people are camping, and I wonder how much these people even play Call of Duty because, I mean, they, they think you should just run nonstop. Like, first of all, the game doesn't even allow you to run nonstop. There, there is only a limited amount of sprint, so you cannot run nonstop, and it will not allow you to reload while running, so it is, in fact, impossible to play while always re or always running. And, you know, stopping to wait to see if someone runs around a corner or look at this kill. Oh, come on. Get him. Get him. <laughs> uh, you know. See, look. Right there. Is that camping? No. That's playing smart. And, um, you know, if you know someone's running around a corner, waiting for them to come to you is not camping. I mean, if you're just sitting in one spot for minutes at a time, just looking down one pathway, that's camping. I, I just don't understand why everyone tries to say everything's camping. See right here? I hear a guy to my right, and I'm wait and then I'm like, no way, he's to my left. And so instead of running out there, I wait for him to come around to me, and I get the double, and then I just leave immediately. I'm not just staying there forever, you know? If you can always can go back to the same spot and there's somebody there, same person every time, that's camping. And right now, I, th I hear somebody behind me. The problem is on this map, though, if you're using a good headset, you can't tell if they're above you. And that's kind of one problem I get into. See, and I'm like, are they above me? Where the hell are they? So, you know, that's how I feel about camping. I don't, I, I'm not going to say I never camp, but I think for the most part, I really don't camp very much. Um, you know, I think I just play defensively a lot. And if you want to get those good kill streaks, most people are going to have to play defensively. You can't rush nonstop and still uh, be on the good kill streaks. And I, as you can see, I've gone through, I'm on this streak, and I've gone through almost the whole map. And yes, I've stopped. Look, I'm, but I'm moving. There's my specialist bonus achieved. <laughs> so, you know, I know there's trolls out there, and there's nothing you can do about them, and trolls will be trolls. But. What's wrong with these guys? Look at this. They don't even turn around. That guy stops and he's like, oh, oh. And look at this nice kill. Through the wall. Bam. Oh, I don't even. I mean, that guy just got raped. <laughs> I'd be so pissed off if I was that guy. But look, I'm still moving around. You know, I'm going to hang out in this area. But staying in one area is not camping. So that's my thoughts on camping. And, of course, people are going to disagree. And that's their problem, not mine. I'll do what I want. <laughs> and so the next thing I want to talk about is the Moab itself. I think like the Moab is special just because it's kind of like a prestige thing. You can brag to your friends, oh, I've got a Moab. Because uh, out of my friends, I'm the only one that's got a non-infected Moab. And only one of my friends has gotten a Moab uninfected. And watch me outsmart this guy. Oh, I'm going to run around the corner. Oh, yeah, you're dead. <laughs> and so I'm the only one who's got it and non-infected. And we kind of discuss whether infected Moabs count or not. <laughs> which I don't think they do. But, um... So, you know, it's bragging rights mainly. Um, but I don't... I don't think they're that great. If you compare them... Obviously, there's nothing in Black Ops to compare them to because your best kill streaks were Attack Dogs or the Gunship, and that was only 11. And, I mean, anybody can go on 11 kill streak or the Hardline 10 kill streak. That's not any kind of accomplishment. All right, now it's recording, as you can see, better picture quality. And so... 
if you compare to Modern Warfare 2's mo uh, tactical nuke, which were pretty stupid just because it ended the game, but you killed the entire other team, your team, and your team won no matter what. So you actually accomplished something. O on here with a Moab, I mean, if you're playing 6v6, the most kills you're going to get is 6. And if people get killed while your Moab's coming in, well, you don't get those kills. So the most I've gotten on a Moab is 5. And for getting 24 or 25 kills, getting 5 kills is not that good of a... <laughs> not that good. I mean, you can get more kills with a... Uh, what do you call it? A Pavlo or an AC-130. And, I mean, I know it does disable their radar, take out any of their kill streaks, And I heard it also keeps them from calling in kill streaks. I don't know if that's true. But, um... It doesn't seem like that big of a reward for getting 25 straight kills. <laughs> and so, I just kind of wish it would be a little bit better. Uh, I know there's guys running down here. <laughs> I can hear them. Oh, there's one. Now, watch this. Watch this last kill. Look, look at them right through that little crack. And, bam. Oh, that wasn't the last one. <laughs> I'm almost there. Oh, yeah. Luckily, this guy doesn't turn around. He's the last one. And that's the Moab. Uh, one thing I found from... Uh, getting Moabs is once I get them I cannot play anymore I'm just so excited and the adrenaline the excitement and I just start shaking and you know I think I had like right see right now I'm 29 and 4 and then I get what five kills so I'm 30 34 and 4 and then I'm gonna not even show the rest I think yeah 34 and 4 and then you see there I go 40 and 10 I went 6 and 6 in the rest of the game just because can't play anymore but thanks for watching